Thank you for watching this video, introducing, I am a chess master from Indonesia, who want to share knowledge according to my experience in the game of chess. I beg you fans of the world of chess so that you don't forget to share, subscribe and activate the bell. But if you are not interested in chess please stay away from here, because we don't need you either, as an illustration we will present an example starting with. Example of irresponsible people starting with pawn e4 pawn e5, horse f3 horse c6 elephant c4 Italian game opening level. Here is one of the captions from the next channel suggesting horse d4, to get ridiculous trap. Even though horse d is a blunder he who suggesting that he also took the wrong step is very uneducated. I emphasize to you not to do something as stupid as that. First. Let's see the explanation from Manyang, it continues explained. He was holding the white fruit continued minister g5. Horse times pawn for king rook and minister then minister. Calipion fort f1 minister Calipion's cut he said if. The minister closed of course the horse times minister. And minister just disappeared let's go one step back. If the elephant closes the horse f3 and we die after we make a stupid move maybe you've seen this even though this could damage the chess theory system science community example you are watching videos on YouTube of course you are looking for information so you can add to your insight about knowledge in the game of chess I beg to allow the master of Indonesian chess to dissect this information so that you can distinguish between what is good and what is bad. Example horse d4 blunder step what is the risk of sequence? In this case, earlier he hoped that we do horse times. Pawn, the best move I recommend horse times pawn after. Pawn times horse, and he has double pawn in the center. Of the chessboard, and it will be a weak point after. He make a wild trap, after a short rokade take a look. At the chessboard now, we have secured our king's position, so we are ready to fight, while the opponents position is still in Tina's rock state, still looking for a way to trap us. I need to remind you to fans of the Indonesian Chess Master channel, very important, who often follow our program, don't trap your opponent in the opening stage, because it's just a joke, play in balance first, prioritize developing the small officers as effective lion relation to each other. Don't force yourself to trap your opponent, except, if there is a path we have to take in that case, so as not to take steps that deviate from the rules of chess theory. Don't take a second step with fruit. That's all, except. If circumstances are forced, an example of a small part 1 explain in this position you move elephant c, then horse e7 then you move elephant a2, then horse f3. Look at the chessboard now. You have lost one step for officer development, then the opponent, that because we have stepped twice with. Different from, opponent steps on horse a5 threatens, elephant. Then we answer elephant a2, we have to step. Twice, because of coercion from opponent's answer. And the position turns black who loses one step for, development officer, because, when he returns his horse. And, black, has moved the horse for the third time, and, we are one step ahead of the opponent, because the, horse's position has been cornered at a5 which is not, good for the opponent's health, example, if we do math calculations, example, some small I explain, horse d4 is blunder steps, horse times pawn after pawn times horse, indeed we have stepped twice, but he has also stepped horse two times, and when the pawn times the dark horse has stepped twice, and it will be our hope to be victorious, example, after minister h5, look at the chessboard now, and black is hard to get a balance move, after a small mistake. Black position is still intact in its original place, don't underestimate this, maybe this has happened when you are playing, that you don't realize it, if your opponent has given you an advantage, and many other basic chess theories, that you have to learn first, please read and understand. If you don't understand, you can give your question on your own cell phone screen. Let's continue with Simon Yang's explanation, 
Pawn e4, pawn e5, horse f3, horse c6, elephant c4, then horse d4, was a blunder, very uneducated. He suggested he also suggested to make the wrong move. Earlier he hoped we would do the horse next time pawn. Step best in this position I recommend horse times horse. Continues pawn times horse, short rokaday after in this position can he win? I dare to cut off both of my ears. What if you lose after he makes a stupid move? There are various answers from black in this position. If the e6 pawn has to be countered by a c3 pawn by pawn by horse by pawn f6 horse develops peace, minister. b3 threatens pawn f. Then minister e7 protects the pawn then d4 pawn. Then look at the board chess he can only parry our blows after he loses tempo. Continues if the g6 pawn the elephant g5 locks the horse elephant g7 the e5 pawn threatens the horse twice. After pawn times pawn then pawn times pawn still threatens the horse. The next step the horse must fall. For free, his chess piece is also under very high pressure. This for the first time. We teach him a lesson. Let's go back. In this position we have seen pawn g. What if he answers? The h3 pawn prevents the g5th elephant, the simple. Answer is the e5 pawn also threatens the horse, continues. Pawn times pawn then pawn times pawn still threatens the horse. Then the horse avoids the fortress d1, of course the e pawn cannot be eaten by the minister. Because of the threat of the elephant times the c pawn, continues the g3 pawn the elephant e3 then the elephant g7 prepares for rokaday, and that will never happen, because the horse will be reciprocated d threatens the minister. After in this position the opponent begins to realize, that all his hopes will end in a cauldron. Continues if the minister h4 horse times the forking king pawn in the fortress. Let's go one step back. If the minister d8 horse f3 the next step is the minister must fall for free. Let's go one step back. If minister f8 horse times. Pawn the next step is not only the rook that falls. But he must die. After doing a ridiculous trap of course his follower of the Indonesian chess master. He will not fall into the trap he wants. Let's go back in this position we have seen the horse f6. What if he responds to the elephant e7, important step minister h5 threatens pawn f, kud h6 protects pawn. Then pawn d4 threatens horse, elephant g4 threatens then minister b5 scot. After pawn closes minister next time pawn, short rokaday minister times pawn, he has to pay for the wrong done. Let's go one step back. If he defends pawn c, and it will be more dangerous for the opponent's health. Example. Pawn c5 horse d4 threat forking fortress c1 elephant times pawn times elephant. Horse sacrifice step f6 if elephant times horse and we will take him to world hereafter. That's because, what, that's because of suggestions from other channels that are not responsible. Let's go back. If Raja F is 8 horses times elephants, and we are superior to one officer without any compensation, and his position has also touched the tip of the spear. Let's go back, in this position, we saw the E6 pawn. What if he responds to the C5 pawn, must be replied. To buy the E5 pawn and the E pawn will boomerang, for. The opponent continues if the horse E7, will be replied to minister f3 threatens the f pawn immediately not any more good moves after in position even if it's still continued and he will receive a more severe punishment example pawns d5 pawns eat pieces threatening horses and pawns f then horses f4 rook e1 scot king d2 elephant b5 scot king times pawn minister f4 scot king d5 minister e5 and the opponent exhales ultimately over his own fault. Let's go back. If he defends his life for a while, example, f5 pawn eats pieces then pawn times pawn, minister times pawn threat of Scott Matt and at the same time threatens the fortress, after the d6 pawn then minister times fortress. Again we excel for the second time. Let's we're back. Let me apply the usual steps, example, Horse d4 is a blunder move, 
must be rewarded horse times horse. Pawn times horse short rokaday, then horse f6 is the best move, fortress e1 pawn e6, c3 pawn elephant e7, then pawn short rokaday pawn, c3 pawn c6 pawn then d3 pawn, up in the tenth move it's still the normal moves, because it was black, made a wrong move in move 3. Even though he made the best move going forward. In theory chess he should lose. Look at the chessboard now. He has to pay for the mistake it's that, by not keeping e pawns, take a look at the chessboard right now. And we are very far ahead for pawn development. Thank you for those who have watched this video. Sorry if there is a language that is less relative because I am just learning to translate English. Of course if the description is in Indonesian maybe if you understand Indonesian, it will be clearer and more concise. I beg you don't forget to share subscribe and activate the bell. I beg you. Humbly. I beg you.